Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah, if you are new. And today we are continuing our Mystical Motherhood series. As you guys know, I took a small break. Uh, I explained it in my eco lifestyle video, but it feels really good to be back. I'm happy to be filming again. I know it's been a while since we've done this Let's Play, but I'm very excited to get back into it. I'm excited to have more babies this episode because uh, I know that we're gonna be moving some teenagers out. I asked you guys who your favorite teen was in the comments and Dawn won by a lot. <laughs> that doesn't really surprise me. I kind of predicted that she is beautiful. So I just thought that I would give you guys a little refresher on what we have left as far as the mystical creatures in the game. So I made a little list here. <laughs> We've got the Island Elementals, Grim Reaper, the Tragic Clown, the Flower Bunny, Servo, the Last Spellcaster, and a Ghost if we decide to get the mod where uh, you can have a baby with a ghost because you can't without a mod. So yeah, that's all that we have left. I'm glad that you guys are still enjoying it. I love you so much. Let's get into this episode. Okay guys, here we are back in the house. It looks like since the game got updated, Miss Brenna here, her hair is no longer working. So it looks like we're gonna have to <laughs> hop into create a sim really quick. Oh wait, her hair is right here. That's weird. Why was it missing in the game? Well, we can give her a new hair anyway because I've got a bunch of new ones. Okay, uh, let me show you guys the new hairs that I have. I actually paid for Simpliciati. I think that's how you pronounce it. This creator right here, Simpliciati. Um, I paid for her Patreon and there are so many good hairs on there. Oh my god, I was like shook. I was so excited. Download, 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 download. Uh, yeah, some really good stuff like uh, these hairs here. They're so, so, so cute. This curly hair is absolutely everything you guys there's a shorter version too there are these like textured buns which i'm just living for i love them uh but let's see do we want to give her a different hair though Ooh, this one looks really nice on her also this hair too like how sick is this freaking hair i am so obsessed with it like it is so hard to find hairs that aren't straight that are like curly or like some sick braids or whatever but uh, she does a really good job with them. Okay, I think we'll give her that hair for now, but let me give you guys a refresher about everyone in the house right now. We've got Sabrina, who's still a toddler because we are waiting until the last spellcaster is born to age them all up into teenagers so that they can be all teenagers at the same time. And then we've got her brother Merlin. Well, I guess they're all brothers and sisters, aren't they? <laughs> but this is the other spellcaster bean that we are waiting to age up. We've got the two vampire babies. We've got Dawn, who is an absolute icon. Uh, and then her brother, Ash, who's also really, really, really cute. I freaking love his style so much. Uh, we've got Servo. I wonder what he looks like under his um, robot outfit. Oh, you can't take it off. Okay, interesting. <laughs> and then we've got Santa's kids, Noelle. She's one of my favorites for sure. I don't know why. At first, I just, I don't know. I wasn't sure about her, but she definitely grew on me. And then this is her brother, Nick. He is a young Santa in training, as you can see. <laughs> So yeah, that's everybody in the house right now. Uh, so for Dawn, we were doing the pipe organ, which she's already almost at level 10. Um, for Ash, we were doing vampire lore. For Noelle, we were doing baking. For Nick, we're doing woodworking. So yeah, all of them were working on that. I have been, so like what we've been going off of, okay, her hair got fixed, cool. So what we've been going off of is just like a level five type thing and then they'll move out. Um, like they have to reach level five in their skill to move out of the house. So let's see, you are almost to level four, Miss Noel. And then Dawn, yeah, she's almost to level 10. So she, she can move out right away if we wanted. Uh, it looks like Ash is done as well. He's level, almost level seven. And then homeboy Nick here is almost to level five as well. So we just really need to work on Noel and Nick. And then we can move everyone out, and then we can have the third spellcaster baby, and then we can have the tragic clown baby. We can hopefully have Grimm's baby in this episode. I know that's what you guys have been waiting for. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, I was like, where did all her relationships go? 
wrong person. I also want to try and have a baby with Servo, if that's even possible. Yeah, that's what we're going to be focusing on. I hope you guys are excited for this episode. I know I am. I cannot wait to see some new babes. Okay, Nick, how's your mood? You are sleepy sleeps. Okay, you can keep sleeping. Noelle? Oh, you're in a great mood. Why don't you bake something for us? Uh, let's have... Hmm... Fish pie. Interesting. I've never had fish pie. Have you guys? I've never even freaking heard of it. Let's do some peanut butter cookies. Why not? Why not? Take a crazy chance. Why not? Do a crazy dance. Is that how it goes? Every time I play this uh, save file, my game just gets so laggy. Here's our erratic butler. Love him. Some of you guys want me to have a baby with him, and I'm just like, why though? <laughs> He's not mystical whatsoever. Oh, get it, girl. She's showing off for us. Calm down, you're only level three. <laughs> um, so yeah, get that skill up, darling. Get it up, get it up. You just need one more and then you'll be uh, good to go. Nope, no bed for you. What else can you make now that you leveled up? Sourdough loaf, cheesy bread, sweet potato pie. I wanna make sweet potato pie. I'm sad that you can't, but oh well, it is what it is. Okay, Dawn. Ooh, you're feeling imaginative. Why don't you just go ahead and max that pipe organ skill while you're at it? I mean, why not? It couldn't hurt anyone. You love... Uh, where's the vampire book? I kind of want you to get to level 7 because you're like right there, right on the edge. So we might as well get you to level 7 because why not? <laughs> I say why not so much in my series. Why not? <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, right. So we are on volume 2 for him. There you go! He didn't even have to read anything. He was automatically level seven. That's what I'm talking about. All right, Nick, I think you've had enough sleep. Please get up. Why don't you have yourself some of this bread and then let's craft something. So with him, all we were doing was crafting toys. So we did a bunch of horses. We did an elephant. Uh, let's do a dragon now. That's pretty sick. Mm. What the heck, Noel? No. No, I need you to resume this, please. Wait, this is mac and cheese. Might as well. Whatever. <laughs> uh, so I have a Celsius today, the Fuji apple pear. I usually have watermelon, but I've been drinking these lately since my mom bought me a 24 pack of them. She was like, oh, I bought you a 24 pack. I was like, thank you so much. That's rad. <laughs> I'll never run out. But, oh my God, freaking servo is working out again. I hate to break it to you, buddy, but that's not going to do anything for you. Wow, you were level 5 fitness? I mean, good on you, but it's literally not going to change your body at all. <laughs> Queen. Oh my god. Dawn is everything. Play haunting music, oh my god, please do. I need to hear this. I love this song. Oh, she's about to max it. Get it, girl. Let's be here while she does it so we can properly congratulate her. Come on. Come on. No! No, no, no. You cannot just stop. <laughs> You're insane. No, you need to keep going. I'm sorry. Brenna, are you tired? Okay, can you get up? There, she did it! She did it! She did it! She did it! She freaking maxed it! Okay, I, uh, I wanted her to come here. Oh my gosh, she's still smoking from doing that, um, sugar skull thing. Can you just, um, uh, give her a hug or something and congratulate her for, uh, maxing that skill? Hug. It's so funny that she's still smoking. Congratulations, Dawn! So proud of you! What is this necklace that you're wearing? I'm 100% positive that I didn't make you wear that, but okay. <laughs> All right, Nick, where is that dragon sculpture? Oh, that is so cool. Oh, he has two of them in his inventory. 
Right on. Look at all these sparkling treats that Noelle has made. She's definitely Santa's daughter, isn't she? Nick, can you um do some more, please? Craft a bunny this time. Oh, and I forgot we had this puppet thing. <laughs> I'm interested, like, what, it's just for show? Seriously? Is it only like for children or something? I think it might only be for children. Not sure, we don't have any children, so I guess we'll never find out. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys, look. Dawn is doing flashcards with Sabrina without even like me asking her to. That is so sweet. Sabrina, you need some um sleeps though, so why don't you go ahead and go to bed? Oh, sweet! Nick reached level five. That is what's up. Can you craft anything new? Oh my gosh, look. Large lumberjack, large bear sculpture. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta. I'm sorry, I know you reached level five, but I gotta see that. I gotta freaking see that. <laughs> so the only teen left is Noelle. She just needs to reach level five and uh, yeah, we're working on it. So I'm sorry that I didn't stream on Twitch this week. I, Eco Lifestyle came out as you guys know. So I did, ooh, it's Flower Bunny Day. So I did want to focus on that because it came out on a Friday and I usually stream on Fridays. It was kind of like a weird situation. I, I just wanted to spend that day to film for that, film and edit for that. So I apologize that there was no stream. We need to keep an eye out for that bunny. Hopefully it doesn't disappear like it did last time. Bye guys, have a great day at school. Actually, I'm gonna bring Noelle home. Oh my God, she peed herself. Holy cannoli. Okay, yeah. Uh, can you come home, please? Leave school early. Yes, I do not care if she gets a drop in her grades. I, it doesn't matter at all. <laughs> I need you to keep working on your baking skill, darling. I know you're mortified from peeing yourself, but you gotta do what you gotta do, okay? Bills, 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 bills. Yes, who is it? I know you don't like handouts, but I just sent you some money. Six dollars. Hey, Servo, can you play the bills for us? $312, that seems very low for this large house, but okay. Brenna, um, why don't you come down here and work out? You're almost there. Almost there. Oh, and you didn't even finish the blueberry bagels, darling. So much bread, so many bagels, breadsticks, a loaf of bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. Yay, Brenna. Go, Brenna. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Oh, oh, there she is. There she is. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> Level five baking. Okay, so everyone is. Oh, shoot. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Um, um, cheerful introduction. No, actually, flirt. Wait, what? You you already introduced yourself? What the heck? Okay. I'm so glad we were able to catch this bunny thing before it left. Oh my god, you're already flirting with the bunny. I didn't even tell you to. <laughs> she knows the drill. She's used to it by now. It's honestly very strange because you can't hear what the bunny is saying. And it's all very awkward and quiet. <laughs> Aww. Thanks, Bun Buns. First kiss already, you guys. Wow. Let's see how weird this looks. Do it, do it. <laughs> She's so buried in it. <laughs> that is hilarious. That is so freaking funny. Merlin's like, mom, bunny. Yes, darling, bunny bun. Hey, hey, where are you going? Okay, whatever, it's fine. We got that relationship up. That's all we really need at this point. Oh, I've always wondered what the bunny does when he like throws his little confetti everywhere. He's leaving flowers. That's so cute. I never noticed until right now. Yay, they're all home. Okay, well, everyone say goodbye to these teens. We are officially moving them out today. Oh man. These two though. They're so rad. 
All right, guys, let's move them out. So I like to move them out with their dads. Um, I don't know if we're going to be able to do that with Clement, though, because I don't even think that he has a house. Um, but these guys' dad is Estevan. So yeah, I'm going to move them in together. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, let's see here. I'm pretty sure Estevan lives in Forgotten Hollow. Yeah, he does. <laughs> okay, so we're going to move them both in there. Perfect, perfect. I'll give them a little bit more money, too. Okay, there we go. And then, yeah, I don't think... Is Clement in anywhere, anywhere here to be found? Oh, there he is, Father Winter. Okay, okay, let's move him into... <laughs> Solani, no, 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 no. Let's move him into um, Glimmerbrook since it's a magical world. I think that would make sense. Okay, perfect. So now all we have to do is transfer them into his household. It's always so exciting when we have an empty or like when all the kids move out, we're able to have more kids. Oh my gosh. Look at all that money Father Winter has. Wow, okay. <laughs> all right, we don't need to transfer any money. We, they're good, they're set for life. Oh no, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to take pictures to- well, I think we could still do it though, we just have to invite them over. So let's do the vampires first for their backdrop. You know what, I actually think I have a CC backdrop, let me see if I can find it. Oh yes, this is perfect for the vampires. Okay, cool. Alright guys, here's the first photo of Estevan and Ash. This is actually extremely cute, Estevan is such an adorable little bean. I love the desaturated filter. All right, here they are. Cute as ever. Big cuties. Let's see if there's a Christmas background here. Rainbow, overcast, forest, cotton candy, cityscape, bigger on the inside, vertical, sunlit forest. What the heck is that? Mm, no, what's cotton candy? Mm -mm, no. What are you doing, Mr. Butler? Oh, you're telling yourself a story. How about rainbow? No. Red carpet? No. Seeing stars? <laughs> what the heck? What is this? Bigger on the inside? No, we need a Christmas backdrop. Let me see if this is just a Halloween backdrop one. Let me see if the normal photo studio has a Christmas uh, one. Let's see. I mean, we could do that one. Have we used this one before? I don't think we have. All right, here we have Clement and Noel. I'm really bummed out about this background situation. This is um not ideal, but it's all right. Love the warm filter. Okay, now all we have left is Clement and Nick. Oh, dang it, Nick. That is not the outfit that I would like you to be in. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just not a good look for you. Um, okay, let's see. Change outfits. Yeah, let's put you in that. All right, here is Clement and Nick. So, so, so cute. All right, guys, we got the photos. We're all good there. Oh my gosh, my game. It is not happy. It's probably this lot, isn't it? I'm gonna have to uh, do something about that. <laughs> if we're gonna add... Oh my god, seven more rooms to this lot? It's just not gonna happen. Oh, please stop getting romantic with Santa. There's this new thing that came with the update where you can just send them home. No hard feelings, no nothing, and it's just beautiful. Bye everybody, thanks for coming for the photos. All right, let's put the photos up. Oh, we did use this backdrop already for the aliens. Darn. <laughs> oh well. It is what it is. Okay, guys, there we go. We got Santa, alien, patchy, mermaid, vampire. Oh, man, this whole hallway is going to be full of photos by the time we're done. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, so let's get the spellcaster baby out of the way. Uh, so we need to invite over Simeon. Hopefully he'll come over. It's a little late, but we'll see. Can we try for baby, like, right off the bat? Oh my god, we can. <gasps> Where's Servo at? Okay, um, why don't you just recharge so that there's no risk of you seeing- Where the heck did our dining table go? No, not our beautiful dining table! 
Okay, I don't think that's the same table, but whatever. <laughs> My game is just freaking out. Absolutely freaking out. Okay, Flower Bunny. I think it's time for you to go home. Uh, where's the send home thing? Don't come in the bathroom. Don't see what you don't want to see. There they go, there they go, there they go. All right, are we pregnant with a third spellcaster baby? Are we lucky or not? Please say yes. Oh my God, Merlin was like, I want to go potty with you, mommy. Yes! My girl, my girl. I am so proud, oh God. Cover your ears, flower bunny. Cover them. Okay, time for you to go home. Bye, Simeon. See ya. <laughs> Actually, hold on a second. Let me make sure I got your eye color and hair color in the brain. Those brown eyes. Oh, yeah. Brownie brown. Okie dokie. Good to know. Also, Ash is not a vampire. You guys wanted me to double check that, and he's not. Awkward. <laughs> oh, well. He's moved out already, so it is what it is. What is going on in here? White cake, white cake, white cake. Why is there so many white cakes? All right, let's cheat her into labor. She's pregnant with a female baby, but we gonna change that to one male and one female. All right, let's go have this, this, uh, oh, wait, 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 no. Well, okay, since it was a female, I guess we'll do another female because we've already had a boy and a girl spellcaster and I was gonna let the game decide what the third one was gonna be. That's right, I totally forgot. Okay, we'll change it back to one female. Hi, Dr. Evil. Oh my, jeez, what even is that? I mean, come on. Like, the CC didn't even try here. <laughs> okay, uh, right. So, zero male, one female, okay. Let's have this baby. I'm so glad it's you, Dr. Evil. No, no computer times, no. Dr. Evil, we missed you. I can't wait to kill you and have your ghost babies. Okay, oh shoot, I didn't even think about names. Hang on, let me check the comments. Okay, a lot of you guys have been wanting me to name the spellcaster baby Hermione. And I think that's be a good idea because Simeon is brown haired and brown eyed and Emma Watson is also brown hair and brown eyed and uh, I don't know I feel like we could have some fun with that and a lot of you guys were um, wanting this as well so there you go. <laughs> I hope you're happy. <laughs> also, while I was reading through the comments, uh, I realized that we haven't had a plant sim baby yet. I don't know if I want to or not because some of the stuff that I've heard about a plant plant sims, it's like when a sim becomes a plant sim, they're not permanently a plant sim. And I think that's kind of weird. Like they're only a plant sim for a few days and then they change back. I would like only to have a baby with a plant sim if they're forever plant sims, you know? <laughs> Take a shot every time I say plant sim. Oh, Merlin, you are hungry, but you're on your way to have some applesauce. Good for you, boy. Good for you. Okay, well, let's- oh yes, Hermione is a spellcaster. Thank the lord. Okay, let's move her right over here and then age her up and give her her toddler makeover if my game will allow it. Oh my god, this house is absolutely filthy. The butler is doing nothing. <laughs> Look! Ew! Yay! Happy birthday, Hermione! Aw, she's a charmer. Oh my god, she's so chunky. Look at her! <gasps> I love her so much! Okay, let's have a look at her and create a sim. <laughs> is this a new hair? I think this might be a new hair. Oh no, it's from Tiny Living. Okay, well, I do want to give you curly hair, so hopefully I have some for toddlers. Let's have a look. All right, guys, is it just me? Or does she look like freaking Hermione? I am tripping right now. I'm gonna put a picture up here just so I can compare and you guys can see the comparison as well. But this hair is perfect. It's absolutely perfect, okay. Let's find you a little outfit now, shall we? She's actually quite plain looking for a spellcaster. The only thing that's like special about her are her eyes. I think they're absolutely beautiful. I could stare in those things forever. <laughs> Merlin was pretty plain as well. He had those eyes, but um, oh, right. We gave him eye sparkles as well. 
Um, but uh, I tried to get them back because you guys like them so much, but I could not find them anywhere. I have no idea where those came from, if that was just like a, a default thing from aging up as a spellcaster. But uh, yeah, unfortunately I can't find those eyes anywhere, so I apologize. We could give her the pretty little stars eye shine as well. Just to make her a little bit special. If you guys are wondering what eyes these are, they are... Sorry, one second. Um, are they these? No, they're these. These are S Club... Shoot, hold on, sorry. S Club 201919. Hopefully that helps. Oh what my god, you guys. Look at this hat. This is by the creator Wakey, it looks like. W-A-E-K-E-Y. Ugh, she's such a cute bean. Well, we have to give her this hat, obviously. <laughs> like, there's no discussion there. So next up on the to-do list is... What should we do? Uh, let's have the clown baby next. Or should we do Servo? Should we try with Servo? Aww. Sabrina's like, I wanna see her. Mom, can you put her down so I can see? Put her down, Brenna. I want to see her too. <laughs> Aw, stop! She's like hiding her from me. Okay, you guys. Next order of business. Where the heck is Servo? They already had their first kiss and their relationship is pretty high, I think. Hold on, let me double check. It's decent. It's decent. Can they have a baby though? We can woohoo with him. Here we go. Let's try it. Oh my gosh, I hope this works. All right, there they go. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm nervous. I am nervous. What do we got growing out here? Daisies? Bluebells? Who planted these? Did we? Hmm, I really don't recall. Oh, look at them. Okay, let's see if a- no, pregnancy thing is not an option. What the heck? I tried to have them risky hook up, but they like did their little dance but never went and did it. Let me try again. No? How come? I wonder if we can do it through command center. No. Dang it. If any of you guys know how to do it, let me know in the comments and uh, I will give it a shot. Ooh, ooh, let's try this again. Honor the dead. She's not smoking anymore, so we can do it again. Grim. Oh, look, she put on a cute little headband. And now she's glowing. Okay. Don't see any Grim Reaper though. Let's text Grim and see what happens. The smoke is all colorful too. That's so cool. I wish more happened besides that. Grim didn't text us back. <sighs> well, shoot. So much for that. <laughs> I'm gonna invite over Nadine. Oh my gosh, look at the little boat going by. That is so precious. I love Willow Creek so much. Oh, there's my orange build. <laughs> Sup, Nadine? How you doing, girl? Let's have them woohoo just to get that relationship up a teensy tiny bit. Servo, stay down here. You don't want to see anything that's going to upset you, okay? And we have to set Nadine to be able to get others pregnant. So I will do that and create a sim right now. Okay, girl. I see you. I freaking see you. I miss my default eyes. They don't work anymore with the update. All right, get others pregnant, boom. I'm kind of sad that she doesn't come over in her clown outfit anymore. Whoa, what are you wearing? Get up, girl, what are you wearing? Is that from Honoring the Dead? That's pretty neat. Okay, let's try for baby. It's an option, hopefully it works. Servo, what's the matter, buddy? Delapidated from low durability. Servo is out here working out, of course. <laughs> he literally doesn't do anything else. Okay, let's take a pregnancy test and see if this works. 
If it doesn't, then we know something is seriously wrong. That shirt, though. I mean, yes, Queen, you are an influencer, 100%. So, Brenna, what's it gonna be? Dude, uh, you guys, look what's hap happening to Servo. He's broken. So, well, I clicked on him and I said, call repairman. So, yep, there he is. Come on, come fix him, please. Hurry before he dies. Thank you so much. <gasps> okay, she's up here trying for baby with Nadine again. I messed with my MC command center settings, so hopefully that fixes the problem that we have with uh, same-sex pregnancies. We have a guest joining us. Hi, Ma. Hello, cute pie. Okay, fingers crossed it works this time. If not, I'm gonna have to cheat it. Which I really don't want to do. Oh my- okay, what the heck? This is just ridiculous. I don't understand why it's so hard for the game to grasp the concept. Oh my gosh, we have 14 children. Holy cannoli. <laughs> okay, pregnancy starts. Where is Nadine? Why is she not here? Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, one female, one male, one male, one female. <laughs> Okay, pregnancy phase and labor. All right, beautiful. We are back. We're back. <laughs> Dr. Evil's back too. He was like, I was just here yesterday. All right, gang. Here we go. We are having the tragic clowns babies right now. So let me look at the comments again for some clown names. I do want to name the girl Penny um, in reference to Pennywise from It. Um, the new It movies are some of my favorite movies, so I would like to do that. And then for the boy, hmm, let's see. There's this comment here from someone named Alyssa Nielsen. Uh, for the boy, she suggests Tristan, and that means sorrowful. I do like that. Oh, these are good. Of course, it's by M. Vaughn. Vaughn? I don't know how to pronounce that, but you always give me the best suggestions. For the boys, Heath, Phoenix, Jack, and Jester. For girls, Harley, Quinn, and Margot. Dang it, those are so good. I'm such a big Batman fan. Hmm. Okay, we have to name the girl Harley, so forget my Pennywise idea. <laughs> For the boy, uh... Let's see what else we got. Someone is actually suggesting Penny, like Pennywise, for a boy's name. Can Penny be a boy's name? Uh, this comment was from Maggie Grover. Hmm. I'm having such a hard time with the boy's name because you guys, you leave me name suggestions, but uh, a lot of you guys leave out the clown names. I don't know. I've been sitting here trying to think of one, and then I was thinking of American Horror Story and the clown that's in the, um... Uh, is it the freak show? The freak show season? I'm not sure. But uh, Twisty the clown. I thought Twisty would be a cool name. So why don't we just go with that? Um, so Twisty for the boy, and then for the girl, we'll name her Harley, after Harley Quinn. Okay, beautiful. Brenna and Nadine had twins. Thanks, Doctor Evil. Another successful delivery. You are gonna be a pro by the time this ends. I wonder which mod it is that's making my game so laggy. I updated my UI cheat extension mod. I updated my <laughs> MC command center. <laughs> I updated my columns mod. I don't know what it could be. Oh, Nadine is still here. She can meet them. All right, let's have a look at them and create a sim. All right, Twisty. You are very, very handsome, like right off the bat. Oh yes, they should totally have red hair like Nadine does. Okay, here we have Twisty. There isn't much that we can do for a toddler, like being a clown right now. We kind of have to wait until they age up. But I gave him some blush and a little red nose and I gave him red hair. I think he's seriously so cute, like one of the cutest toddlers that we've had so far. Now, as far as an outfit goes, this is going to be so freaking hard. So clowns wear like suspenders and like full body suits, that type of thing. Oh my god, should we give him this? 
I know it's for like Christmas time, but it kind of looks like a clown suit, doesn't it? I'm getting clown vibes from this. Am I the only one? I hope I'm not the only one because I think this is the outfit that I'm going to give him. <laughs> when it's in like red and green, it looks very Christmassy, but with all the other colors, it doesn't. I think I'm liking this colorway the best. I hope you guys don't hate it, but like there's seriously no other option. <laughs> okay guys, there is Baby Twisty. Let's move on to Miss Harley here. I'm so excited. These are some of the cutest toddlers ever. All right guys, this is what I've got going on for Harley. Like I said before, like toddlers don't really have a lot of like, I can't like put any jewelry on her. I can't put any makeup on her, which is a bummer, but I found these cute little um, like bright, vibrant, like hair accessories that I could put in her hair and I wanted to give her like a double hairstyle just because it's Harley it's like based off of Harley Quinn and I gave her some little heart eye shines and a bunch of blush so I hope you guys like her so far but it's gonna be very hard finding an outfit again of course but let's see what we got I mean that's kind of cute bright colors and stripes and polka dots I feel like it's very clownish Oh, there's this! This is perfect! Oh my god, this is perfect! Hmm, I don't know what colorway either. I'm debating between... Actually... I think this one. And then, let me change her hair, um, her hair sticks, the color of those, to... Maybe yellow? <laughs> She's so cute! This is like, I'm not 100% sure how y'all are gonna feel about her and I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm, I'm liking her. Okie dokie, Harley is all done. I hope that you guys approve, I really, really do. All right, so we've got Harley and Twisty. Okay, so I think we have room in the household for one more kid. <sighs> so I'm not really sure what to do since we can't have a baby with servo. There's really no point in keeping him in the house. Am I right? Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So we can't have any more babies. Well, I guess now is probably a good time to end this episode then. So in the next part, we will work on the toddler, or uh, age up the toddlers. I know, I know, I just gave them their makeovers too. That's kind of a bummer. Maybe what we'll do is we will age up the spellcasters in the next episode and then have them work on their uh, magic. So I decided to have the spellcaster babies level up their magic skill. What the heck are you doing out here, Hermione? Get in the house. <laughs> Um, oh, and one of you guys suggested, shoot, I'm so sorry I forgot your name, but I just saw in the comments that um, each spellcaster, depending on who their parent is, they learn five spells from that, from that school of magic, if that makes sense. So like Sabrina will learn five mischief spells, Hermione will learn five, uh, I think he's practical magic, right? five practical magic spells, and then Merlin will learn five untamed magic s spells. I think that's a good idea because getting to level five of the magic, like getting to level five magic is actually kind of hard and it takes a lot of time. So I'm thinking whatever we get to first, either level five magic or five spells uh, will be good enough. I hope you guys are all right with that. And then for the two clown babies, did we decide what skill we wanted them to level up? Let's look at the skills and see what makes sense for a little baby clown. Comedy! Perfection! Okay, so I think that Twisty will do comedy. And then for baby Harley, mischief. Yeah, mischief. That's perfect. Because she's Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn is very mis mischievous. So yeah, I think that makes the most sense, for sure. Okay, that worked out very nicely. I'm so excited about them now. You guys have no idea. Why are you so sad? New sibling, oh dear. That is something that you're gonna have to get over extremely quick because there are always new siblings around here. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> 
I hope you guys do too. Oh my gosh. And you know, I did my best. I did my best with what I had. Oh look, Nadine came in here to say what's up to her babies. Also, before next episode, I'm gonna have to freaking figure out what the heck is going on with my game and why it's lagging so badly. And also, I think I'm gonna figure out how to, how to save each room, because I really don't know how to do that and probably build another lot maybe next door with all of the rooms um i think that's probably contributing to the lagginess of my game is because there's so much stuff on the lot and the more rooms i add the worse it's gonna get so yeah i might move the orange house somewhere else and use this as like a room museum or something like some a lot of you guys have suggested so yeah and then i'll have to build the clown baby's room which i'm very excited about it should be very bright so i'm gonna leave this episode right here please let me know what you think of the two clown babies did i nail their outfits and please let me know what you think of hermione as well she's seriously so 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 adorable i mean look at those eyes and the little missing tooth is like sending me over the moon as well. Also in the next episode, hopefully, we'll have more babies. So let me cross off clown off the list, cross off spellcaster. So all we got left, island elementals, grim reaper, the flower bunny, servo if it's even possible, and a, the ghost of Dr. Evil with a mod, hopefully. And then a lot of you guys uh, were game for the last episode to be a Patchy and Brenna wedding. So I think that's what the last episode will be. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all of the amazing suggestions in the comments. Please leave me names for um, Island Elementals and for... Um, you know, I think that's it because a lot of you guys have already commented names for Grim, for the bunny, for Servo, and for go for the ghosts. So I need Island Elemental names. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I love you, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.